In the first hour of our school day, we study economics. Currently, we are following the Russian Ukrainian crisis and its impact on our economy. In and out of our class, we play the stock market game, following the New York Stock Exchange, NASDAQ, and other major exchanges. My favorite thing to do is probably keeping up with the stock market while playing our stock market game. During second hour, the junior class learns English or British literature. In this class, they learn the ins and outs of writing college level papers, researching historical literature, reading many books, writing poetry, and much more. They are currently preparing ideas for essay writing after reading the play Hamlet. My favorite part of English class is probably writing meaningful poems. At third hour, most of the class goes to the art room to exercise the creative side of their brains, while the other goes to the rec center to use the exercise facility for physical education. The students create beautiful paintings, drawings, sculptures, and more. My favorite thing to do in art class is probably using the pottery wheel. When fourth hour rolls around, the students engage in financial literacy class. They learn with the senior class how to be financially literate. This class teaches us how to be smart with money and create a budget. The students also learn how to create a financial plan, forecast their financial futures, write checks, create a resume, build credit, and much more. They often joke about bad financial decisions like gambling or getting into credit card debt. My favorite aspect to Finlit is learning how to manage my money. Next is lunch period where all the students gather into the commons to eat their lunches. Many topics for conversation that the junior class have in particular are about homework assignments, college level classes that they're taking, the morning classes they just survived, what wild homework Miss N, their English teacher, assigned, or their standings in the stock market game. The next class is chemistry. In this hour, students learn about the chemical makeups of a variety of different items in the periodic table. For example, one day they learn that the same elements we eat and drink can be altered even the slightest amount to become a lethal substance. This class, the junior class, learns best through hands-on work and experimentation in science. So they all enjoy it when the teacher announces that they will be doing a lab experiment Luckily for the juniors, they do labs quite often. Currently, they're working on scientific notation and significant figures. This insightful discussions with the teacher and classmates definitely are my favorite thing because they encourage dialectic debate and conceptual thinking. Sixth period is a study hall. Normally, the students will work on English homework in this hour because they always have it. On the off chance that they weren't assigned a boatload of homework, they'll work on their Start College Now classes offered through NWTC. These are classes that give students an opportunity to get college credit while they're still in high school. The juniors always help each other out and make sure each one of them stays ahead. Near the end of the day, in 7th hour class, the juniors learn Algebra 2. They work on solving extremely mind-boggling equations. Luckily, they have an awesome math teacher who breaks things down into simpler ways. Sometimes, she'll even crack a joke or two to liven the mood. Right now, they're learning about inverse functions. Favorite thing to do in algebra is learning logic to solve complex problems successfully. The last hour of the day is called Extended Learning Time, or ELT. This is where the juniors prepare for the ACT. They go through the subjects of math, science, writing, and literature. The class enjoys relaxing and taking this time to go at a slower pace to solve problems, write, and look at science experiments. This is where the juniors end their day. At the end of this hour, they get on their backpacks and bags and prepare to be dismissed.